Greetings everyone, welcome back to the stuff we've already seen. I hate it when you do that. Yeah, well, I'm, I hate it. it's okay. I'm like... trying to get the volume. Oh. Hello. Why do you women always take forever to get ready? It's okay. We're hoping you men will leave without us. I don't like his haircut. I don't like him. Uh, I mean, he's a good guy. No, he saves us I swear he uh, beat himself in the future. Tire iron. Uh, well, not you. Repeatedly. Uh. Sort of. No, mostly Max. Right? Does he save Chloe too? Chloe. No. Is that a black mm. eye? No. Insubordination. No wonder your mother's worried about you. Oh, that's sweet. When I was your age, I got into my share of scraps. But it's not responsible. You His head is moving weird. Do better. <laughs> Tell me <you're> <laughs> He's like a problem. mother dirt bag. Well, that troop insulator's probably cracked. You know what a spark plug does? Just like your mother. Yes. Oh. Do you not hear me? I said I know what it does. <laughs> then go grab my socket wrench oh. set from the garage, and we can get moving. Okay. What is this? Quality time? Ugh. Better just get the socket wrench and get this over with. To the garage. What are you doing? Oh. Did it's you forget it. how to move? No, I was moving. It just wasn't going until I pressed the other buttons. Uh oh. It's okay, we're going. I don't know why. Why is she moving like that? What? What's David doing? Leaving stuff in our garage anyway. Does he think he's moving in or something? Well, you know, Chloe. <laughs> Do these have chapters on hot wiring your mom's boyfriend's car so you can drive it off a cliff? Uh oh. Mom's been cleaning again. This was the photo Mom took down from the living room. Guess we don't have room for it and David's mustache. <laughs> David Lawnmower. Maybe Mom and I like our lawn the way it is. Ever think of that? Dad's toolbox. He used to get so excited whenever anything sprung a leak or busted. <gasps> Dad's old camera. <laughs> Do they even make film for these anymore? Yeah. The stereo used to be in Dad's workshop. Oh my god, Dad, 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 Dad. You know what your problem is? Gets it first. <laughs> Should fill this with gasoline just in case David's car ever catches on fire. Oh. Fifty fifty chance I smash him in the face with this. Sixty forty. Maybe ninety ten. It's a massive car. Tiniest penis in all of Arcadia Bay. Oh my god. She is relentless. A little more hustle wouldn't have killed you. See what's gunking up the works there? That's a sign carbon of carbon deposits. Deposit. No shit. You know, you could actually be good at this if you lost the attitude. My attitude is what makes me special, David. All right. Dear God. Fine. Whatever. That was so awkward. Holy shit, he really did that. <laughs> hey, you're taking those tools with you, right? Every house needs a good toolbox. Oh! You dick! <sighs> You've already got one, but thanks. <laughs> He didn't have to laugh. You shouldn't have. You shouldn't have fist bumped him. You should have left mm. him hanging. 
Instant regret. I can't help it. Ready to. I know, it's hard Ready. not to be a... Please don't want to talk. Please don't want to talk. I want to talk to you about oh, something. Oh, God. Fuck. We don't <laughs> have to like each other, but you will respect me. You've no. enjoyed enough of a vacation from having a father figure. So there are some things I want to be real clear about. Ignore and endure. Shut this down. Shut this down. Shut it down. Shut it down. Respect him? I think it's time I show this asshole I'm not interested in anything he has to say. What's clear is fuck you. Language. You are way out of line, young lady. Language? French's language, military language, mustache. I don't know. Up to you. Je m'appelle don't give a shit. Okay. You've got a smart mouth, don't you? You can't threaten me. You know how I know? Because you just tried, and fuck you. Okay. Good. I can crap bigger than you. Oh. Just remember that. That's really gross. Oh. You're the crap oh. master. Oh. Shit, no, I should have pressed that I one. That's what I smell. A giant oh. load of crap. I'm not good at you, this. Your mother! Breaking her heart. Ugh. Leave mom out of this. This is about you and me and you being an asshole. I was in the army. What? You will respect me. Who cares? Fuck. Doesn't the Constitution say no soldiers quartered in civilian homes without consent? Because for the record, I do not consent. Look, now, in this house, I have my job to do and so do you. Have, you have no job. Do I come to your place of employment and... Oh, that's right. You don't have one. If you were a man, it's I... It's cool. If you were a man, I wouldn't go so easy on you either. Jesus! I don't know why oh I my God. Destroyed. Mission accomplished. Now drive. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> oh, I'm just going to take a nap. Nap time. I've, 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 I've expended my power. <laughs> wow. I mean, we gotta have Chloe be a little sassy. Can't just have her all be... Country music? Oh, God! What is this? Dad. Dad love this song. I don't know, it's Uncle Bob's. It's come back from the grave. I'm just gonna tell you that I miss you. What a beautiful day. Socket ranch. If mom were here, she'd tell him to turn that junk off. I know what a spark plug does, jerkwad. Purse? I guess mom left her purse back here. See that coming. I don't know, that was scripted. <laughs> Very much so. Because there's but... like there's like oh it's like I'll beep run them right on top of you. Like that's I don't know if he just wasn't paying attention. Clearly no. That was bad. Oh gee. It's a fear of mine. Hey. Where are we? Oh gee. Hey. What the hell? Out of the car, Chloe. You're gonna be late. <laughs> Oh god, not this goddamn place. You can say thanks for the ride. Shit. Thanks. Don't use that sarcastic tone with me, young lady. I can see you rolling your eyes. Uh, hello? I was actually saying I see everything. I'll warn everything. What? 
Oh. All right. Well, we're Hello, Black Hell. <laughs> huh. That's right. When we were playing uh, in in the uh, in Life is Strange, she's already kicked out of school or dropped out. I'm not sure which. I forget. She kicked out or dropped out. Uh, both. <clears throat> she drop kicked out. Yes. That doesn't sound like someone's pissing. It's a fountain. I don't see a fountain. I am not what? wanting to go into here. It's okay. You're okay. I mean, at this rate, you won't be. Don't talk to me. Oh, is that Elliot? Hey. It looks like Elliot. Chloe! Oh, oh, shit. Hey, Elliot. Wait, what happened to your face? Do you need to go to the nurse or something? What? This? You should see the other guy. Guess it's true then. I heard you had a hell of a night. I mean, people are talking about it. People can eat a dick. <coughs> Even social media haters can't ruin how awesome last night was. So, how about the Tempest? Blackwell Theater at its most pretentious. Yeah, totally. I know it's gonna be lame, but I was thinking... Do you want to go together tomorrow? No. Fuck no. No oh, way. No, the Illuminati. I'd rather have my eyes gouged out with rusted forks. Yeah, right. Me too. No way, you're probably a creepy stalker like Warren. Yeah. Hiding in the bushes outside a yeah. fucking yeah. house. For sure. Is it, well, I liked about Max is she always managed to avoid having to answer any questions because something would happen. Got or she could just rewind time. time. Got my DVD. That, that was good. I've still got time. I still can't class. believe that Warren shit. Uh, Nathan in tights. Can't unsee. Oh shit. I didn't hear what my... Yeah, that. My objective. Oh god. Where? Sure. Got it. It's <laughs> on my hand. How could I possibly make it through a day in this place Drugs. without a little chemical assistance? They mess you yeah. up. Well, at least not for now. Okay. Oh, you got a message uh, from Steph. Ew, right, there was a fountain. Picnic tables with Mikey. Mikey or Mickey? Mikey. Mikey. Alright, how do I to the picnic? Uh, Holy fucking shit, the it's Victoria. The future needs excellence. Jeremiah. The future is an asshole. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Victoria. The future no. Needs is that excellence. Victoria? It is. The future is an asshole. Stop it. Oh, God. Uh, Victoria Chase. I'd rather vomit razor blades than talk to her. But guess what? <clears throat> <gasps> Carrie Price. Carrie Price. It's Chloe. Oh, right. I'm just teasing. People have been taking me so seriously since I won the Beacon's Young Artist Award for my photography. Min, 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 min. You don't wow. say. Between that and the Vortex Club, it's hard to keep people from putting me up on a pedestal or whatever. Is her hair different? But you know yeah. all about that. What, with Rachel Amber? Am I right? Ugh, talk, I don't fucking know. I don't want to talk to her. Talk about Rachel, I guess, yeah? Wait, what about Rachel Amber? Rachel posted a slamming selfie of you two having the time of your lives. Do tell. We murdered a man. <laughs> it was a pretty normal night for us. A little music, a little dancing. We murdered a guy. <laughs> you are so funny. Oh, seriously, though. I didn't realize you and Rachel were such BFFs. I don't like We're you. We're really not. Uh, so, what's she into? You know, what's her thing? Is it drugs? I'm not judging or anything. I figure if she's hanging out with you, she must be into some effed up shit. Oh. You know? I mean, look at your face. Oh. Seriously, I don't know why you're talking to me about Rachel. Oh, everybody loves her. Little Miss Perfect. So you're jealous of Rachel Amber. That's what's happening right now. Gotcha. Oh, God, I don't have time for this. I didn't even finish the chemistry assignment, and you're being you. Ugh. Sabotage your homework. I'm sorry, Victoria. I didn't mean to be rude. You know, I finished the assignment. Oh, this bitch. <laughs> She's not. You, 
totally terrible. Help me. Of She's course. pretty bad. That, that last girl gonna was die, anyway. right? If I'm remembering yeah. correctly, they're all dead. The You're all dead. <laughs> yeah, because fuck Warren. Uranium, because carbon. Fuck that guy. Potassium <laughs> and uh, uranium again. Does that sound right? Perfect. Hey, thanks, Carrie. Eh. No problem. <laughs> oh my god. Why are you walking like that? You fucking stick with two marshmallows. <laughs> Who? Samantha. Who are you? Samantha Myers, school wallflower. She could give you a run for your money, Max. I really just don't feel like talking to people, though. Is it bad? Mm, 50-50. Should I? Should no, I don't give a shit about her. Who the fuck cares? Talk to the important characters that we know are going to be, like, you know, important. Just random fucking people. Why did they make her walk like that? It's so fucking weird. If I had known the Celestial Avenger was bloodied, I would have totally given him my potion. It was a skill challenge. Potion wouldn't have worked. Skill challenge? I gotta keep an eye out for the next save, because we gotta end it soon. Who wouldn't understand? Eh. Give me a break, nerds. I've heard of tabletop games. Cool. Got my DVD? One Blade Runner. Director's cut, coming right up. Oh my god, of course. Sweet. Five bucks, right? Keep it. I'm just glad someone here appreciates the classics. You even asked for the director's cut, which took out the shitty voiceover and replaced it with a sweet dream sequence. Dream life over real life. That's my motto. I agree. Right on. Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? Rachel Amber? You're asking me? Didn't you two go out last night, or was it just like a friend thing? What's it to you? Because I don't know. If, I don't. We're not friends. I don't know. I guess. Why do you want to know? <laughs> Steph has a crush. Chloe, you should join our game. Yeah, I don't have fifty hours right now. <laughs> Thanks. <Steph. laughs> oh. We're at the end of the campaign, so it'll only take like twenty minutes. What else have you got to do before class? Yeah, sure. Let's play. Right? Hey, what the hell? Game on, nerds. Okay, that's a... Here's a character sheet. That's a seat. You are an elf barbarian. <laughs> nice. I could totally see myself as an elf barbarian. I know. I'm good. All right, let's get started. You were both famous heroes in the kingdom of Avernon, a once peaceful land now laid to waste by the bloodthirsty raiders of the Black well. Alone, you have fought your way through the raider camps, seeking their warlord leader, Durgaron, the Unscarred. As you enter the final camp, bloodied and weary, you see your fellow hero approaching from the opposite direction. I raise my staff to you in greeting. I am Elamoth. Of course you are. Wizard of the Third Circle, foremost advisor to King Tiberius, and sworn defender of Avernon. Introduce your it's character. A... Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm From Dragon an elf Age. barbarian mm -hmm. named... Crazy uh, lady. Crazy elf. Archer. Uh, fuck yeah. Calamastia. <laughs> Super into it. Not bad. The two heroes... Hold on. Elephant like narrows his eyes at the elf okay. in front of him and says, I am here to defeat Durgaroth, the Unscar. In the name of King Tiberius, what makes you think you are worthy to fight alongside me? According to my character sheet, I once made a man. What? I once stabbed a guy in the chest with a sword, and it went all the way through and killed the guy behind him, too. True story. <laughs> you stand at a three way crossing. <laughs> to your left, the raiders' training ground. To your right, their prison camp. Straight ahead, an enormous, ostentatious tent. That could only belong to Durgaron, the Unscarred. Which way do you go? Straight ahead, right? We're supposed to kill the Dur dude. Elamon frowns. The raiders could have some good loot at the training ground, and surely it is our duty to free all those prisoners. Your choice, newbie. Where do you wish to go? 
We got prison camp, we got a training ground. Leave the game. <laughs> Warlord's tent. It's up to you. Just don't leave the game. Because I want to see where this goes. Loot sounds good. Let's go to the training ground. Sweet. Upon arriving at the training ground, you are spotted by a heavy set orc who immediately shouts and points. There are a dozen raiders on the training field, all of whom raise their weapons and charge. No. Okay. So what do we do? I cast Urgle's Acid Blast. Um, overkill? Bam! You conjure up a wave of acid that washes over the charging orcs. Yeah. Every raider suddenly starts screaming and writhing in pain. There's a sweet and sour kind of smell as the flesh melts off their bones like warm candle wax. Holy shit. You see why I haven't really needed a partner? The heavy set orc sergeant still remains. He runs at you swinging a massive warhammer. All yours. I like the sound of Fatal Cleave. <laughs> okay, Gotta let's say. end this. Fatal Cleave! You swing your great axe downward with both hands. The orc blinks, then splits Ooh. open like a hot dog bun. Fuck yeah! I'm awesome at this game! It's going well. What about the loot? Well, as the training ground is now a roiling pit of acid, it's unlikely any loot survived. <laughs> Don't worry, Alamon guy. Oh we all make mistakes. Alamon, no, it's Calamastia, the elf barbarian, is most wise and forgiving. What's next? You want to free the prisoners or yeah. do the war? Yeah, okay. Clearing out Let's the go area. to the prison camp. You behold a field of guess we're stuck in this. cages. Yes. Each imprisoning a human villager, calling out for you to free them. Only a small elderly dragonkin is keeping watch. He notices you and, in terror, runs into one of the few empty cages and locks himself in. Ah, uh, poor little guy. What's a dragonkin? Dragonkin are like little dragon people. They're assholes. I bet he has all the keys. Ah, uh, okay. I also bet his name is Rathion. Hey, shit face! Get out of there! <laughs> the dragonkin hops up and down, shaking his ring of keys at you. He shouts in a strange language. Whatever he's saying probably isn't flattering. Got any useful spells in that robe of yours? Nothing that wouldn't blow up the cage and everything in it. Tent with bread. Intimidate. Intimidate. I like the 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 anytime it's got the curse words around it. Can I do that? I want the little bastard to shit his pants. You can try. What do you say? Listen up, you little lizard. Unfortunately, he doesn't speak common. Which means he can't I cast communication on the dragonkin. Shit. Really? Now he can understand every word you say. Time to work some real magic. So this oh is called a skill challenge. Where you again. try to use Oh, I know what this is. I grab the bars of the cage and lean in, nice and close. He steps back, his scaly skin quivering in fear. What do you say? Meat puppet shoes. I wiggle my hand. Hey, dragonkin guy. Want to become my meat puppet? How it works is I shove my arm up your ass into your head, and then I can control your mouth from the inside to say things. Uh, he doesn't seem to like that idea. Neither do I. The dragonkin pleads with you. Please don't harm me, tall one. But I cannot give you key. Durgaron, much taller and meaner than you. Uh, you're short, I say. But you can always get shorter. Give me the key, or I'll chop off your legs and beat you to death with them. The dragon can cowers before you, looking left and right. He opens his jaws, and you think he's about to yell for help. I interrupt his yell by shoving my axe into the cage, pinning his head to the bars without hurting him. Then I say the following. This is going to be good. Here's what's up. I'm going to carve the skin from your bones. Then I'm going to turn your skin into a little leather handbag that I'll shove your skinless body into so I can carry it around with me wherever I go. That way, 
The next time some asshat refuses to give me a key I want, I can pull your body out and show them what happens. How does that sound? <laughs> uh, wow. That was nuts. I'm going to give you a plus 10 bonus to charisma. Go ahead and roll. A small pool of urine collects yeah. under the elderly dragonkin oh as, hands trembling, it hands you the keys. Then it dies of fear. Oh, no. shit. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Go team. Why don't you start unlocking the prisoners? I'm on it. As you free them, the prisoners run away from you in fear. What's next? It's tent time. Tent you time, enter the tent, tent, tent to find Durgaron. Warlord of the oh, Raiders it's a torn. The Black Wall, oh, sitting comfortably at his throne. He's a huge red-eyed minotaur, oh, minotaur swathed in a fine thing. black cloak, gripping a two-handed sword that's easily six feet long. His mm. laughter bellows. Ha, 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 ha. Your lands and people are already mine. Your deeds here mean nothing. Your kingdom was weak. You are weak. What an asshole. I got this. I cast Zael's Cataclysmic Cone of Fire. The fire fizzles out on contact. Durgeron laughs again, holding up his right arm to show off his bracer of fire immunity. Shit. All of my battle spells are fire-based. Except for, you know, Acid Blast, which someone used unnecessarily to show off for Chloe. Calamastia? <laughs> What'll it be? Oh god. What's Wrathful Rush? It's like a shoulder slam, an angry, angry shoulder slam. Okay, I do that. You scream with wrathful rage, then charge. Durgeron is caught off guard, and he fails to dodge. You slam your shoulder into him, knocking him back and doing some damage. Hell yeah. Next. <laughs> oh, holy shit. Uh, annihilation strike. Oh, okay. shit. That sounds boss as fuck. <laughs> One? Oh. That's bad, right? Not for me. As you take your first step, you trip on a rock, collapsing onto the ground in a clangy jumble of metal. Your axe swings wildly to the side. Mikey, roll a reflex save. Oh, no. Three. Your axe strikes Elamon's leg. <laughs> um... Legs, plural, severing both feet at the ankles. Oh, that's not good. I am so sorry. <laughs> Durgeron moves toward the crippled Elmon. Oh, shit. I told you this was my best boss. You didn't tell me my character might die. Durgeron approaches, stomping his bloody hooves. Stomp, stomp, stomp. This is all my fault. It's sort of. What should I do? Dance, jump in front of Elamon. Jump in front of Elamon. You gotta save him. I jump in front of Elamon. Wow. Thanks, Chloe. I mean, thanks, Calamastia. Okay. Durgeron has now turned his attention toward you. Bring it. He charges, thrusting madly with his great sword. Shit! Oh no. Your attempt to dodge his thrust fails. Durgeron laughs as he impales you on his blade, lifting you high into the air. Seriously? I can't do anything with that stupid bracer. I'm sorry, Chloe. Hey, I chopped your feet off. We're even. You feel your strength draining away as Durgeron lifts you higher into the air. It hurts like hell. What do you do? Uh, take out the arm, right? Right? Remove the arm, so that he can do magic against him. Mm. I bring my axe down onto his arm, the one with the fire bracer thingy. Oh, brilliant! You'll Let's have see. to roll Good. high to hit. You're almost dead. Twenty. Fuck yes! You bring your axe down in a wicked chop, severing his arm completely. His bracer of fire immunity clings <laughs> to the ground. All right, I cast fuck him up, Angles. Gignomi's fire strike of flame. Oh snap! 
Lying on the ground, you conjure a flaming spear, which flies from your hands to spear Durgaron in the chest, incinerating him completely from the inside. That's great. Damn, Elamon. Durgaron is defeated, but your wounds were too great. I'm afraid Calamastia is dead. I actually feel sad right now. Better to have died a hero than live your as a Your legs coward. are missing. Are you going to be okay? Just that was it. fun. Check out what okay. I drew. When did Mikey's got serious that? drawing skills. He's like a fire mage. He'll just cauterize his ankles and uh, stump it back to Sounds fucking... Sounds horribly sad. painful. Right. It, oh, there's a save. Yeah. Well, there you go. I'll adventure with you anytime. <laughs> we'll see. All, all right. That was cool. That was fun. Thanks for the game, nerds. <laughs> all right. Take care. Stay scared. DVD, check. See next you next stop, time. Chemistry class. Oh, boy. Joy. Hey, how did she change that? It was DVD. She didn't write whatever. Magic. Oh, <laughs> fuck you. Ugh.